All right, we got a little update here on the play set that we're building for my daughter. Uh, again, the other one, she's kind of outgrown, it kind of rotted. So I just want to show you what we got done here. Uh, we did a double rim joist. I'm starting to learn all the lingo here. Never built any decks or wood in my life. So uh, helped out a few times, but. Uh, so we notched in the six by six, put the rim joists all the way through. Then we offset our uh, our boards here. Um, we got the through bolts, two through bolts per board. And uh, it's really kind of difficult making sure that they didn't touch each other. So whenever they went all the way through, um, got everything level. These are 12 foot long six by sixes. I have approximately three feet in the ground with uh, hundreds of pound of uh, quick creep all the way around it. Uh, the four by fours are about two and a half feet in the ground. One of those is a little bit taller um, up there. We did not notch the <laughs> four by four for obvious reasons, uh, but we did do a double through bolt as well as a screw or two on the inside. Every one of the joists has a two by six joist hanger. I use screws, not nails. Um, again, I've, I've never built a deck. I don't do wood. I'm a 20 year HVAC guy. <laughs> so here's our notches. A uh, little cool thing I learned on a guy from YouTube in order to notch wood, set your depth on your uh, skill saw and just run a bunch of little lines across it. Then you just knock them out with a hammer. Super easy. So uh, learned a lot. Thanks YouTube. And hopefully, uh, this may give some of you guys some ideas. But uh, we did do the joist tape on top of all of the joists. Uh, we want this thing to last. And again, we are in Florida, so uh, hurricane, you know, always a little concern. So I did go big with the six by sixes. Uh, this thing isn't going anywhere. We do have plans to uh, build a, uh, reuse the slide. You know, you can get these slides online for like 600 bucks, it's crazy. So no reason to uh, get rid of it. But it doesn't go as high as the, uh, the new platform. So we're gonna build a little deck that comes off about four foot. And we're gonna put this thing up right here to where it empties out right here. Um, we do have uh, the boards and everything over there for the handrails up top and the balusters. Um, and then we are gonna be doing a little fence wall here and then uh, my next job is to tear out this joist right here and we're going to use this area probably cut this one right here do a cross beam and a cross beam but we're going to build a little escape hatch to get up into the play set uh, as well as a little ladder on the outside somewhere but just a little update on what we're doing here and then last but not least, you know, I put in these uh, six by six posts a long time ago for a big sunshade. It was a triangle sunshade. There's the old post over there too. And then we have the third one right there. And uh, well, I didn't really measure that out correctly. So um, it was useful, but the way the shape was wasn't the best. Uh, so we ended up reusing, designing the playground off of this original post where I could reuse that and I actually got lucky here because this post um, we're probably going to do some heavy duty triangle supports let me do this boom triangle supports right here and uh, these beams are really close to lining up to each other a um, little off by a couple inch or inch and a half uh, but worst case we're gonna get a 12 or 13 foot beam to go from here to there. And then this will all be swing set. So, um, not sure if the beam's gonna go all the way to the top of the nine foot, probably bring it down to the eight foot mark where the old one was. Uh, but yeah, this is what we got going. Uh, again, leave your uh, comments below. Uh, let me know if there's something that you would have done different. Uh, again, this is my first time. Love constructive criticism. Uh, and also love giving other people ideas. Uh, so just let me know what you think. Leave me a thumbs up. And uh, if you don't mind, subscribe.